May 25th, the test of self-interest. If thou wilt take the left hand, then I will go to the right, or if thou depart to the right hand, then I will go to the left. Genesis 13, verse 9. As soon as you begin to live the life of faith in God, fascinating and luxurious prospects will open up before you, and these things are yours by right. But if you are living the life of faith, you will exercise your right to waive your rights and let God choose for you. God sometimes allows you to get into a place of testing where your own welfare would be the right and proper thing to consider if you were not living a life of faith. But if you are, you will joyfully waive your right and leave God to choose for you. This is the discipline by means of which the natural is transformed into the spiritual by obedience to the voice of God. Whenever right is made the guidance in the life, it will blunt the spiritual insight. The great enemy of the life of faith in God is not sin, but the good which is not good enough. The good is always the enemy of the best. It would seem the wisest thing in the world for Abraham to choose. It was his right, and the people around him would consider him a fool for not choosing. Many of us do not go on spiritually because we prefer to choose what is right instead of relying on God to choose for us. We have to learn to walk according to the standard which has its eye on God. Walk before me.